Welcome to Val d'Isere and welcome back to another YouTube vlog. Well, it is a scene from the holiday, yet there are 10 of us that we've been dumped in this village and we cannot find our chalet. 10 girls, a loaded luggage, and we are literally <laughs> trying to find the address. But we're here to celebrate one of my best friend's 30th birthdays. It is going to be the biggest laugh. It's going to be an incredible time, and I cannot wait to take you with me. We have <laughs> finally found our chalet. We got rescued by a wonderful young man who collected us in a minibus and all of our luggage. And then in here is the chalet. It is absolutely ridiculous. So on the lower level, we have where we keep all of our ski equipment. These are heated ski boot, lovely panels. So obviously where we're gonna get ready in the morning and the fantastic thing about this chalet is that we can literally ski straight out. Down here is the spa area. I will certainly be swinging on that swing. Amazing pool. It is so warm in here. We have a sauna and a steam room. This is just the vibe. This is the vibe for this week. And then upstairs, I love the decor, the traditional chalet wood, the skis. Beautiful, beautiful oak. Here we have the rooms, lots of rooms. <laughs> so we are sharing, as it is a girl's trip, I'm sharing with one of my best girlfriends, Chloe. You guys have met her before. So this is one of the rooms. This is Laura's room. Isn't this fab? It's just amazing. And look at these views. Literally, you can ski straight out of the chalet. It is absolutely amazing. This is Christy and Sophia's room. They have a little balcony and check out Mr. Snowman out there. He is so sweet. All with ensuite bathrooms. This is our boudoir for the week. Gorgeous twin beds. Close sleeps right, I always sleep left. So the perfect sleeping couple. Again, we have a gorgeous view of the mountains. Literally people are skiing past, it's amazing. I'm gonna lay out all of my sort of skiing accessories here. We have a lovely bathroom, a little loo and a sink and a big shower in here just perfect. Upstairs we have the amazing living space. It is so cool. Laura has completely spoiled us. Isn't this just such a vibe? Have the really cute living room the girls are already making themselves feel at home you guys are literally such a vibe over there and then we have the kitchen laura's doing all the business figuring out the best runs this is the kitchen i mean it's just so cool i love all of these bits it's just so retro look at that what do we think this is it's just amazing very very cool vibe black kitchen Nice, clean countertops, such a beautiful quality chalet. I cannot wait for this week. We are off to go and get our ski passes. Chloe is here, my precious baby girl. And uh, we're off to go and get our ski passes and all of our equipment. I'm not quite sure what this vibe is going on here. <laughs> this is not on brand at the moment. However, we have some seriously cool ski outfits. I will do a full what I brought to Val d'Isere with me. Oh my goodness me! Hi! Do you speak talking? Hi, the precious people! <laughs> You're so scrubby! Oh my goodness! You're so cute! <laughs> What's your name? Oh my goodness me! You're so cute! Right. Sophia is on champagne duty, of course, opening up the bolly, celebrating. Gosh, what? Happy birthday, Laura! Woo! This 
is the chosen outfit for today. Holland Cooper was so kind and sent the most beautiful and chic ski wear I have ever seen. So I'm going to bite the bullet and wear this stunning luxury ski jumpsuit today with the matching thermals. I love all the gold hardware. I just think it looks so elegant and classy. Obviously my ski gloves, I've got socks, I've got my Roxy goggles that are years old and then how chic are these bad boys. I'm going to be looking very trendy on the slopes. So that is the the outfit for today, mostly Holland Cooper and oh, I just cannot wait to get on the slopes. Just come up for breakfast and look at this setup. My goodness me, we're gonna be ready for those slopes. Oh, I'm gonna devour the croissants. My goodness me, this looks incredible. <laughs> are you ready for the day, girls? Oh, yes. We are ready for the day. <laughs> Woo! Woo, the boots are on. <laughs> Let's do this. First gondola of the trip. How are we feeling, girls? Are we feeling confident? Confident. We're feeling confident. <laughs> it's like winter wonderland out there. First ski lift of the day. Yeah. Woo! Oh my goodness me. I cannot wait to get to the top of that mountain. <gasps> this is just so breathtaking. The blue skies are popping out. It is, however, minus 19 at the top. <gasps> Rather chilly, but rather gorgeous. I'm so grateful to be here. Just done our first run and it was incredible. It's so good to be back on the slopes. It's almost like muscle memory. You get you get back into the flow of skiing. I'm with some seriously advanced skiers over here. <laughs> Chloe is literally like a professional. We've got snowboarder Lydia and yeah, it's just amazing. However, it is minus 20 and my hand is currently freezing so I will take you a little bit down the slope show you some of the spectacular views and just oh God, we're gonna no. have yeah, so God. much fun you. see you guys at lunch you're gone now will you call me back yeah I know that yeah I know that you're the traveling slightly out of breath but we have just got to lunch which I believe is going to be amazing I need something warm maybe a hot chocolate and some frites it's a known fact yeah, I know that. after lunch skiing no, I'm, I'm slightly worried I am I'm slightly yeah, worried yeah. you are I wish you luck once you've seen all the things all the places I Okay, so we are officially the last women standing. <laughs> oh my goodness me, serious skiers. Look, every single turn is currently empty. We're going to the very, very top. It is minus 25. All of our snuds are frozen. But the skiing is, I mean, it's just sensational. Thick, fresh snow. The slopes are incredible. We've been doing just the most amazing runs I definitely think this is the best skiing I've ever done and tomorrow we're meant to have bright blue sunshine I must say visibility is pretty poor so currently can't see anything but the girls are going in front of me <laughs> for safety purposes <laughs> and we're just having the best time Except celebrating this <laughs> very special egg over here <laughs> wonderful afternoon we ski back to the chalet we did Laura a gorgeous cake and all of these images of her whole life with all of the different girls which was so special 
We then had a sauna and the steam in the spa. And then I've just had a shower, did my full on Leonora Dyson blow dry. So big bouncy curls. And then this is my outfit of the evening. So this is an absolute find. I got this on Sunday in Maximara. It's on sale. It's a combination between like a wool and a cashmere. It is so soft and warm. It's got these beautiful horn buttons and it's like a dress short situation. I mean, how fabulous is that? I paired it with a dark tan Holland Cooper belt with the gold hardware. Again, another find. These are Bobby's snow boots. They're very like Laura Piano, absolutely love them. And then have a pair of chocolate Walford tights and of course my gorgeous Pieta Costello camel coat. This comes with me absolutely everywhere and really, really elevates any single look. You could be wearing really a high street sweater dress. You pop this over the top and it looks so luxurious. And that's when I always say you have to invest wisely in those key luxury pieces and you will bring them out time and time again and make every single outfit look spectacular. And whilst she's here, let's do a quick Chloe Wynn Stanley photographer <laughs> vlogging over here. Uh, go and follow her, number one. Number two, let's do a quick outfit of the evening, Chloe. What are we wearing tonight? So I have got on my gorgeous Clementina Mint velvet headband. I'm obsessed. I need to invest in those. She's They're amazing. so incredible. She's one of my brides. The blouse. We need to know about the blouse. The blouse is a Zara purchase, very last minute purchase for the trip. This belt was my grandma's, which she left me, which I love. And then I've got my Bimber and Lola boots. And then leggings are from, I think they're from, actually from Abercrombie and Fitch, which is so rogue, but they do really, really good leggings. I love them. Really they're such leggings. a great fit. And, and they like... do them in every cut, every length, so you can really find what works for you. Okay, I'm going to have to like tell you to go back a bit. We need to, we need to see these trousers. They're good. I love them. They're a winner. I spent about an hour trying on a million pairs, so. They're incredible. Anywho. It is dinner time. Our driver's just about to arrive and we're going for dinner in the Vardas there this evening. So, of course, I will be taking you guys, so let's go. We've just arrived at the restaurant for this evening. Oh, this looks gorgeous. Loving the deco on the outside. <laughs> As you can see, it is snowing like crazy. This is like winter wonderland. Here we are. Here we are. Royal Restaurant, I believe the name is. Are you first, darling? And you oh, thank enjoy. you, my darling. How gorgeous. Oh, it's lovely and toasty and warm. finished dinner we are on the lookout what oh, lovely attractive hair in my face we are on the lookout for a bar to go and have a few drinks and have some fun we've just gone to find what is it called laura pd no no what's the place uh, we just tried to find coco rico. coco rico it's closed it's only like 11 p.m so and it's closed early. anywho we're now like literally trekking across a slope <laughs> across a slope and we are walking down to pd's apparently <laughs> where we can go and find a drink i'm very glad that we're having an after dinner walk <laughs> yes it's i've eaten an obscene <laughs> amount of fondue it was so delicious though Oh gosh, there are people over there. I'm quite enjoying this. Can you, I think you should sit. I think that's a snow <gasps> Oh my snow god, park. there are people. No, look, there are people skiing in the dark. Yeah, it's a snow park. It's a snow park. How does that work? Oh, you should poo, yeah. Late night skiing. I couldn't even see today, let alone in the dark. <laughs> that, no. no, that would be epic, actually. That's that a hard no from so. me. This is my first ever girls' trip. It sounds crazy. Obviously, I didn't go to university, so I didn't have any of those experiences. <laughs> oh! almost choked. Um, I didn't have my hen do because it got cancelled twice. We meant to go to Vegas and then Marbella all got cancelled because of Covid. And so this is my first ever girls trip and all I have to say, we have to do this every single year. I have Maddie. And Tori behind me. Oh, 
Well, How are we feeling cool. about this no, track? We're absolutely fantastic. Yeah, no, not lost at all. Just having the best time of life. <laughs> we're in search of a vodka and tonic. Would, would recommend to a friend. Yeah. Would recommend to a friend. However, I would recommend having a map or having any idea as to where we're going. I would recommend not walking across the ski slope. I would also recommend in the dark. Town you yeah, ditto. This is a room all there. We're fine. <laughs> we're fine. Um, however, where have the other girls gone? Uh, we finally found a bar that's open. In the process, the vegan has officially frozen. <laughs> Chloe, you're okay. You're okay. Mummy's got you. Mummy's got you. We found La Petite Danos, which is AKA PDs. <laughs> Night. What a <laughs> night! What a night! <laughs> we are the last girls standing. Our car is finally here and we are leaving the club. It is very late, I hate to admit, but my goodness me, I don't think I've ever had so much fun. What Here's the girls' night. trips. Here's the girls' trips. I think everybody, if my advice is to anyone, they need to do more girls' trips. Without a shadow of a doubt. Okay, it's about three in the morning and I'm probably gonna sign off for this evening. No makeup, very sweaty from dancing. In Val d'Isere at PD's Le Petit Denois. See you in the morning. Good morning, my darlings. What a fun evening. I must say, I'm feeling a little bit worse for wear today, but the ski wear is on and I'm ready for another day on the slopes. The conditions are truly perfection. Look at this blue sky. Isn't it just exquisite? We are literally just about to go, so I thought I'd do a super quick outfit of the day. So I've had to balance you guys on like a fire hydrant thing. So fingers crossed you don't slip off, but I am wearing my favorite moon boots, full Holland Coupe today. I have the gorgeous thermals underneath, which are so warm, yet so, so chic. Then I have the Salopet jumpsuit that I showed you yesterday. I am absolutely obsessed. It creates such a beautiful silhouette and of course the toasty warm ski coat. This is such a fantastic combo. It is so chic, so warm. I love the faux fur hood. I must say I'm feeling really rather grateful for my enormous black Holland Cooper glasses. Not only are they going to hide my hangover <laughs> from last night, they are also going to protect me from the sun. They also look so bougie. <clears throat> excuse me, it truly is such a pinch of a moment to even be here with such an incredible group of women, independent, entrepreneurial, career-driven, beautiful, inside and out. It's amazing. Anyway, let's go and hit these slopes. Day Love two, it. girls, are you ready? We're feeling a little bit more worse for wear today, but <laughs> we're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna smash it. And actually bright blue skies, glorious sunshine, and we're gonna have some fun. Where are we going for partying? Folly douche. So folly douche. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Oh gosh, lots of dancing on the tables. <laughs> and with this little pro, <laughs> but look at this view. Isn't that breathtaking? It's cold, <laughs> but it's breathtaking. Gosh, just beautiful. And it's so nice that it's not too busy. Here they come. Here come the girls. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. They are doing so well. Christy, you're smashing it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> want to take a moment and just take this in girls of what an exceptional view it's huh incredible. the lake the mountains the blue sky is so stunning what a day truly is a red letter day today okay girls are you ready for your first folly experience no, we're going to get on the table Let's do this. 
So this is the vibe we're going for, for Apreski. Yes! <laughs> Go Laura, she's ready! <laughs> and tonic. I've just had a full glass spill over me and it has frozen. <laughs> it's time to go home it's time and to go back in the sauna. sauna. Yes. I think I've got motion sickness. <laughs> I feel like I'm on a <laughs> I'm not surprised you've got motion sickness. It's a good day. After probably a good hour in the sauna, I have finally warmed up. Look at my face, I'm like a tomato. I don't know whether that's from the sauna or whether I've got wind burn. <laughs> I look like a tomato. Anyway, I've got the face packs. I bought 10 Rodeal face packs. We've just ordered pizza and we're gonna do face packs and have a gorgeous little spa evening early night. So we've got another busy day of skiing tomorrow. So we have the Rodeal masks. I brought the Dragon's Blood, which is a hyaluronic jelly face mask. It's, it's hydrate and tone, lots of hyaluronic acid, raspberry keto extract and ginkgo mm -hmm. interesting and then we have the snake one which is a freeze and smooth I don't think I'm gonna do this one because I'm absolutely stone cold frozen so let's go with the dragon blood so whilst all the other girls are clubbing and you know doing things that single and girls who are ready to mingle do we are <laughs> I look so awful. <laughs> 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 I apologise in advance. Oh, yeah. I apologise in advance. I don't want to terrify any of you, but this actually is an amazing mask. Um, and it is really, really going to help with my wind burn and just soothe and hydrate and deal with the stress that my skin has had to cope with. <laughs> 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 It's halfway in. Oh, it's so scary. <laughs> it's so Look scary. at the state of me. They could have picked better yeah. colours, couldn't they? <laughs> I look like, I look like one of those horror films that you Yeah, it's not. Off. It's actually terrifying. <laughs> but we're going to be so beautiful underneath. <laughs> looking beautiful. The things we do for beauty, ladies. Yeah. Things we do for beauty. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday from Val d'Azer and a very very tired and puffy faced Leonora. We had such fun yesterday. I am feeling mentally and physically exhausted. I've been such a moaning mini. My shins, we went out out in ski boots. It's a hard no from me and I do not recommend it to anybody. I can hardly walk this morning, but I'm up bright eyed and bushy tailed because I've got to shoot a few bits and pieces. So hair in rollers, mostly other people are still sleeping. Chloe's over here being a supportive morning, friend. And my face is so puffy, but I do have a couple of things that have been saving the day. Literally like look at these puffs. I think it's because I'm tired. Obviously I've been drinking, been eating fondue and burgers. So naughty, I promise I will get back on it when I get home. But these two tools have been absolutely 
absolute saviors. Game changer. Game changer. Game changer. Like this is obscene. It's, yeah. So this is Current Bodies, one of Current Bodies skin tools, and basically you can do your own at home skin facial. It's almost like a chirotherapy because it's really really cold. You can store them in the fridge and freezer, but actually the metal that they've used, they remain so cold. So this one you can really really sculpt and almost do a little bit of lymphatic drainage and the difference is mind-blowing like the bags and in the morning cheekbones, as well. cheekbones so you can do this and really really create a very very defined cheekbone look oh my goodness I can fully appreciate that I look like an utter maniac right now Anyway, so this has been saving my life. And then you've also got Current Body's Cairo Roller. And again, I at home store this in my freezer, but because it's been so cold, I've actually been popping it outside in the snow, you know. So this I roll over my face and it really does help with depuffing, any swollen. I've actually been rolling it over my ankle. I've got a very, very swollen ankle at the moment from skiing, bad diet. And it's been really, really helping with reducing any inflammation, and that is just heavenly. Anyway, well, I'm going to go and roll my face a little bit, pop some makeup on. I need to shoot a couple of bits and pieces before we hit the slopes today. So I will show you those because they are gorgeous. Chloe has been literally my absolute saviour with helping me shoot. You guys know that she is the most incredibly talented photographer. Obviously she specializes in weddings, but she's such a good friend. She helps me with everything else. So she's been literally outside being like, Leo, get up that mountain. Look left, look right, hand on the hip, smiley face. I mean, it is like an operation. An operation but we're efficient now. We know we're we're efficient. efficient. We smashed it yesterday. I have no doubt that we will smash it today. Anyway. As I said, I'm going to spend a little bit of time trying to deep half my face, pop some makeup on, certainly pop some more clothes on, and I will see you outside. This is the first outfit that I've got to shoot. This is a new cardigan from Piazza Castello. It is literally my dream cardigan. Look at the bell sleeves, and then it nips in at the wrist. It's got this beautiful plaiting detail, the stunning horn buttons, but they're almost like a milky brown. It's just exquisite. And then of course, you've got the Pieta Costello gold badge. I just think it makes it look so luxurious. But this cardigan truly is a lifetime piece. You do have to look after them, but this is just breathtaking. I cannot wait to shoot it out in the snow. The lighting is amazing. I've actually just got my thermals on and my Bobby's boots, because I think the fur at the top goes with the color of the cardigan. I cannot wait for you guys to see what we're about to shoot. Day three, I think we're all moaning minis. <laughs> Our shins are killing us. Some of us are hungover. Others are ready for round three. And yeah, we're almost there. Girls are just putting on their skis. My helmet is here before anybody questions. About to pop it on. We're gonna have such a fun day today. I'm gonna try and get everything in. Lunch, après, folly, dinner and bar. Let's do this. mountain and look at this view it's so so bright but look at that it is incredible breathtaking views <gasps> right let's ski to lunch now the speedy girls are together are you ready for some serious skiing as charlotte says <laughs> oh my goodness look at these views Right, what is our plan, girls? We're gonna ski to lunch or ski to Bailey's coffee. Bailey's coffee. Oh, golly. Right, my hand is about to drop off. Yeah. It's so cold. Yeah. See you in a bit, guys. I've never had so many burgers. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> just had 
lunch, we're in the gondola. Half of us are going to folly, the other half we're going to do a few more runs because I feel like this is our last chance to see you. So we're going to do a couple of runs and then meet the girls at folly. And then after folly we're going home, pre-drinks, and then we're going to eat for dinner and then a club. Yeah? I mean dinner no, but club yes. Okay, dinner no, club yes. I like how you think. Yeah. So we're going to go to Folly, yeah. and we're going to go the going home, yeah. get, the get them a few boots off so we're not hurting our feet like we did yesterday. Stay right. boots on, taxi to Cape Rico, see where the night takes us. Okay, I'm liking Can you it. not get a shuttle to Cape Where can I crowd surf? No, they, they remember they all only go the other way. Yeah, Coco, like the guy on site, but don't wipe it. us out. Okay, no, I won't. I'm, 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 I'm hoping that you guys are going to hold me up. We're either going to be like... Yeah. Yeah. We're just working out where we're going. We're gonna do a couple of runs and then meet the girls at Folly. Um, I think we're gonna hit the black run and go down here, but it looks quite icy and mogul-y. But it is almost the last part of the skiing that we're gonna do this trip. So I feel like we should go out with the bang. Um, oh gosh, I still can't get over this view. Girls, are we doing it? <laughs> we're doing it. Oh gosh, we're just left. So many moguls. Charlotte's just there in the black on the left. You've got this, babe. Got this. <laughs> I don't know if this is a good idea. That was quite tricky. Oh my god, look at the sun on the mountains. Yeah, I'm filming. I cannot see you. I'm waving at you, you see me. It's minus 20, I'm such a good friend. Okay, I'm zooming in on you. Oh, it's a good, it's a strong start. It's a strong start. Some lovely turns. Oh, oh, she's down. Oh, up, oh, she's down. Are you okay? <laughs> Absolute chaos because Lydia was texting. No, yeah. Charlotte texted me and said, Lydia's come to find you. We don't have a house key. So oh they're no. slightly ahead of us. They don't have a key. They've come to find you. <laughs> yeah, but then Charlotte texted me saying they were in the gondola. I was like, I have a key, but I'm on the lift. And so Charlotte was so like, they're going up and we're going down. I don't know where they are, but they've been meeting at the lag. So uh, if you, uh, if they go to their guy, then they're halfway to Bowser and there's only one bus from that guy. Back. No, they have to get they're to Timothy. Get they have to They've get got to get Timothy, but Timothy's apparently on Geneva today. It's carnage. Sure carnage. Well, I'm, I'm really proud to say I'm actually alive. <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm alive. decided that we couldn't physically walk to the chalet and back so we came straight here and we have no shoes yes. do you have any plastic bags that we could put on our feet oh chalet is a little fine. Long guys, we're we're have one minute. okay laura i think we're gonna have to run yeah oh god i think our toes are gonna get frostbite Right. Should we just do it? Have we got everyone? Wait, I did, I Don't slip. With shoes on, so. Okay. So far, so good. I'm liking the mat. Okay. Ready? <laughs> go. Go. Go, girls. Go. No shoes on. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh, this is cool. Okay, girls. Get to the mat. No, she's dropped a glove. Mat down. Mat down. I don't know. I have cold feet. <laughs> it is perishing. It is minus 25. <laughs> I feel like my, the, the liquid in my eyeballs are freezing. <laughs> don't cry. You're okay, babe. Don't cry. We've got this. Oh my God. Crazy. Well done team. I'm actually out of breath. We're currently getting ready 
to go to Coco Rico's, which is like, well, it's a club. It's like, like Apres Ski outdoor club vibes. But we were so cold yesterday. Minus 25. So I'm currently putting on the layers. I currently have uh, three layers. I've got five on so far. So far. So, oh my God, I'm going to freeze. Yesterday, I, it was not happening for me. I went home. I was so cold. Yeah. So it's a vibe. Too much. So, so how many layers have you got? On? How many layers have you got? You look well, beautiful. You really so nice. I'm currently at yeah. um, at two layers on the. I've only got two layers. Hi, fans. This is Zoe. Hi. Hey, everyone. So, um, I've got two layers on legs. I've got. I've got my legging. I'm wearing exactly what I'm wearing skiing basically. Look, how many to your skin? Uh, on here, leggings and trousers. So just two. And then I've got two thermals, this, and then I was, I'm going to wear my monthly jacket. I think I should probably put the fleece on. Have to put the fleece on. Then I'll put my, the zebra print one. Zebra print one. Yeah. I'm going to go with the lovely jumper that um, Lydia kindly lent me. Because oh, I can't wear a £600 cashmere cardigan. No, not too where we're going. No. What we're doing. And Minky wants to crowd surf. Love yes! it. Okay, well, you look fabulous um, and everything. Thanks, so. Right. Okay. All I can say is wish me luck. You guys know I don't really drink. I don't tend to party. And these girls are hardcore. So I will see you at Coca Rico's because, of course, I am taking you. Chloe has okay. got her fifth layer on? My fifth layer is a Piesta Costello cashmere towel neck, which quite frankly I have lived in for the last half many months. Um, three pairs of socks, two pairs of leggings, leather trousers. The gorgeous pigtails. Gorgeous pigtails. The hat. Wish me luck. It's a vibe. Oh, no, it's a vibe. Gosh. See you there. The final night. We're going big girls, aren't we? We're going big. in one night like insane dancing incredible band the best girls in the entire world good morning everybody just walking up to the top for a little bit of breakfast It has come to the end of the trip and it's time to go home. Our transfer has just arrived and it's going to take us about 2 hours 50 minutes to get to the airport and our flight is this afternoon. It's been the most incredible time. Truly, truly memorable. So many incredible memories made. And But yeah, we've still got the airport and the flight. <laughs> no doubt we'll make some more memories. So let's get to Geneva. I've got my little bus partner over here. We've done about a three and a half, almost four hour journey to Geneva Airport. <laughs> Thanks, we are Dory. all starving hungry and <laughs> hanging. <laughs> <laughs> this one back here needs a diet coke. Christy, how are we doing? She's fine. <laughs> <laughs> the girls are currently struggling. I actually feel great. This one's just going with a bubble hat and sunglasses. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. It's a real vibe. The nuggets did help. The nuggets. Yeah. The party yeah. people like is not for everyone. You say party. You say people. Party. People. Party. People. people. <laughs> we basically lost our voices by yeah. this point. Yeah, and I'm not quite sure what hurts more. My shins, my feet, my head. I don't know. My soul, my soul hurts. Yeah, my soul. Yeah, I have my Although soul. actually it's rather full. Oh, okay. But, all, so but also broken at the same time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Everything is broken. I'm, I'm very grateful that actually nothing's actually broken. But, yeah. but feeling very yeah. sore. Sore. Oh, very, very sore. Lots of ankles. Two sore ankles. Two sore nice. ankles, yes. Yeah. Very much so. Yeah. Anyway, we will see you guys back in London. Hello my darlings, welcome back to England. I'm the land of living, I have to admit. It has actually been a couple of days since we've been back. Girls trips are unbelievable, but I was broken. Like genuinely, physically and mentally broken. My shins are black, I have odd bruises 
all across my body of which I'm not even going to try and remember and certainly not go through my camera roll because um yes probably all self-inflated <laughs> But what a spectacular trip. So many memories made. Just the best girls. Truly such an incredible group of women who are all strong and independent with incredible careers. But most importantly, they are just such special humans, like genuinely in their soul. And I feel so grateful and very, very lucky to have them as solid girlfriends. And as I said, first girls trip. I mean, how are we gonna top that? I feel like we have to do it every single year. We're gonna do a really, really fun girls summer trip in Mallorca at the new house at some point, um, like June, July, maybe even August. Um, so we'll have a little bit of a reunion trip. But I am home. I am back to work and I am on it. I have so many exciting things coming up and I promise you I am back to YouTube now. I took a little break, mainly because of my health, um, but I will fill you in on that on the next vlog. It was my plan to do a 2023 goals, ambitions, intentions um, first. However, this vlog has come first, so that will be the next vlog and I will fill you in on the reason why I took such a break. Um, due to burnout and health um, but anyway I'm gonna bring this vlog to an end I truly hope <laughs> this is the group our group is now called party people <laughs> um, as I said, I'm gonna bring this vlog to an end. I truly hope you enjoyed it. It was a bit of a wild one. Lots of parting, lots of screaming. Not my normal, luxurious, very calming. Um, but you know what? I just wanna show the real me and the things that I do and for this to be the most genuine and authentic channel. That's really what I want. I just wanna be able to be myself and bring you along with me for this ridiculous journey. Anyway, I'm yabbiting on, so I hope you guys have a wonderful evening. I am about to have a vegetable soup and a green juice because this girl needs to detox. <laughs> have a great evening, guys.